so just stretch your whole body here now slowly keep pressure pump on the mat sweet flat only lift up your chest up here only lift up your chest up look up spread your finger to the mat squeeze your hip and compress your abdominal to the mat elbow make sure straight lift up your chest up and just hold that for a couple of breath this is medicine for your spine just keep compress your abdominal to the mat if you if you like you can keep your eyes closed just hold your posture for 30 seconds we are practicing for our back strengthening and maybe we are practicing for sciatica pain whenever our lower back pain so do so do this practice for every single day that will improve your lower back strength and relieve pain your lower back keep lifting your chest up and keep pressing your palm to the mat slowly come down rest your forehead down place your both palm this side your chest slowly here inhale roll back in your shoulder and lift the chest up no too much force only just try to be hold that spread your finger and press your palm to the mat no too much force in yourself slightly bending your elbow if you feel comfortable you can slightly come up but make sure keep your elbow come closer to the body and hold your posture for 30 seconds only for just 30 seconds lifting your chest up look front so we are practicing only for today our back strengthening if you are feel your middle back lower back upper back back pain your your lower lumbar strengthening so do this practicing do this posture for every day that will strength strength your spine also strengthening your back muscle okay slowly come down rest your forehead down and place your both palm beside your hip beside your thighs okay but place your palm beside your thighs Press your palm on the mat and only keep trying to lift up your chest up. Compress your abdominal to the mat. Look front. Just feel the stretch for your back. Squeeze your hip. Contract your buttock muscle tight. Elbow straight. Palm facing up. Press your back of the palm on your mat. Hold that, hold that. Exhale, slowly come down. One more time, inhale, only lift up your chest up. Head up. Compress your abdominal to the mat, look up. Squeeze your hip, contract your buttock muscle tighter. Look up. Just hold that, feel the strength to your back. That will improve your lower back strengthening also. Contract your hip. Good for your digestive system. Good for your lungs. Exhale. Slowly come down. Just both hands straight. Bend your elbow. And put your both palm under your chin. Here. Then bend your knee. Keep your hip come closer to the hip. This is called to Makarasana. Exhale, legs up the straight. Inhale, keep your heel come closer to the hip. Come closer, come closer. That will improve your strength, your back. Exhale, straight. Come on, continue for 30 to 40 time, like a two minute. Just continue. Make sure, no stress. Just relax your facial muscle. Just continue, keep going on.
Yes, yeah, really slowly, slowly. Try to feel the contraction in your lower back. Feel the strengthening your lower back. We are doing here for gentle movement for lower back pain. Yeah, middle back, yeah, for back pain. Just continue more 30 seconds. Last 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Slowly keep banging your leg, elbow side, elbow facing side, interlock your fingers, drop your head down. Then same time, drop your both leg left side here. Then come, come back to your spine, right side. Come back to the left. Twist. Come back. Exhale, twist to the right. Twist to the left, both leg right side. Inhale, come back. Exhale, twist here. Inhale. Exhale, twist. Inhale. Exhale, right, left. Look. Feel the stretch your right side. Stretch your elbow down. Inhale, come back. Now slowly keep your legs straight. Now, one more our our upper back strengthening portion that that we call to snake pose, sarpa asan. So swing your both hand around back. Interlace your finger, roll back in your shoulder and lift the chest up here. Look up. Just hold your full posture for 30 seconds. Just squeeze your buttock, contract your hip tighter and stretch your shoulder back. Stretch, more stretchy. Feel the contraction in your back, stretch your shoulder. Lift up your chest more up and higher. Okay, slowly come down and release your hand beside your thighs, palm facing up. Just try to simply focus your breath and keep press your forehead to the mat. Again, both hands at the back, interlock your finger, go back in your shoulder and lift the chest up. Snack pose, this is good for your back, strengthening your back. Just contract your hip tighter, gazing up to the ceiling, stretch your shoulder back. Okay, slowly come down, put your both palm under your thighs, come into Salabhasan, keep your feet flat, chin touch on the mat, elbow come closer to the body, push your shoulder down, inhale only right leg up, exhale right leg down, only for right leg 10 times, come on 2, slowly and slowly, together. Three. That will help you strengthen your lower back. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Eight. Nine. Ten. Right leg down, left leg, come on. 10, 9, 8, 7, 
six, five, four, come on, three, two, and one. Slowly drop your leg down. Both hands front, interlock your finger, drop your forehead down, so be relaxed. Focus your breath. Okay, put your both palm under your thighs again. This time alternate. Inhale right leg up, exhale right leg down. Inhale left leg up, exhale left leg down. Come on, let's start. One, two, slowly, slowly. Come on, three, together. Four, five, six, seven, eight, come on, nine, ten, last ten more. Nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Drop your leg down. Keep your both hands straight, drop your forehead down. So be relaxed. Just focus your breath. Try to inhale and exhale slowly. And feel the change in your body. Feel the change in your lower back. This will help you to strengthen your body, strengthen your back. Good result for your lower back. Good result for sciatica pain. Okay, one more time. Full Superman, uh, you are called to uh, Purna Salabhasan variation only. And you are called to Full Locust Pose. Put your both palm under your thighs. Press your back of the palm on the mat, inhale, both legs up here, exhale down. If you feel uncomfortable, you can alternate leg. Okay, no problem. Let's start, man. One, come on, two, three, four, five, six, seven, Come on, eight, nine, ten, okay, last ten more, nine, eight, last seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one hold that lift up your both leg up one two contract your hip three four five six seven eight nine and ten slowly come down just put your both palm beside your chest inhale roll back in your shoulder lift the chest up expand your hip case elbow come closer to the body and stay there Hold, one, squeeze your upper back, two, contract your hip, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Lift up your hip up, 
Then slowly open your knees wider. Keep your big toe touching each other and come into wide knee child pose here. It is called Shishu Balak Asan Ya Shishu Asan. Stretch your shoulder and push your hip back to the heel. Just hold your posture for 30 seconds and make sure keep your breath very soft and slow. Just try to focus your breath and stay there with me. Inhale, slowly come into tabletop. We are doing here for cat to cow stretch forward, strengthening our back and stretching our back. So open your wrist shoulder distance up, open your hand shoulder distance apart and open your knee only hip joint, hip distance apart. Inhale, lower your belly down and lift up your chest up. Here, push your shoulder down and lift the chest up. Exhale, hunch in your back. So here, slightly push your hip forward and more round your back, hip forward and round your back, hip forward and round your back, lock your chin. Inhale, arch your back, lower your belly down, push your shoulder down and lift the chest up. Exhale, hunch in your back, lock your chin. Inhale, arch your back, look up. Exhale, hunch in your back, lock your chin. Inhale, arch your back. Lower your belly down and keep lifting your hip more up and higher. Keep your navel come closer to the mat. Exhale, hunch in your back. This is this will help you to strengthening your back. So continue for 20 to 30 moments. Inhale, arch your back, look up. Exhale, hunch in your back. Inhale, arch your back, look up. Exhale, hunch in your back, lock your chin. Inhale, arch your back, look up. Exhale, hunch in your back, lock your chin. Inhale. Full strengthening, arch your back, lower your belly down, lift the chest up. Just hold your posture for 30 seconds. Lower your belly down and squeeze your upper back. Just stay there and keep trying to head back and keep gazing up to the ceiling. Normal breath. Lift up your chest more up and higher. Exhale, very hunch your back, lock your chin. Just hold your posture for 30 seconds. And push yourself a little bit to hunch your back, round your back, contract your hip, hip forward. Like your body pressing to the, fo uh, push to the forward on your wall. But no moment your shoulder. Your shoulder as it is and push your Hip forward, round your back, more curve in your back. Like your head touch on the wall and you're pressing your hip forward. So your shoulder as it is, only pressure your hip to forward. 
Okay, inhale, come into neutral position. Sit in child pose. This time, keep your knees come closer to each other. Rest your abdominal on your thighs. Knees come closer. And rest your abdominal on your thighs. And both hands behind your back. Left hand catch your right wrist. And drop your head down here. Just try to hold that. This is good for your lower back. Good for your abdominal. And keep your breath very soft. Feel the pressure your abdominal. Inhale, slowly come back. Put your palm on your mat. Now, open your knee. Only hip distance apart. Only keep your both hands straight here. Okay, and keep no movement your hip. Hip as it is, hip up 90 degree here. So make sure your knees and hip are one line. So, hand straight and keep try to press your shoulder down and keep press your upper chest to the mat. Okay, this will help you to stretching your shoulder and more extension your spine. Just try to be straight there for 30 seconds. Keep your body, come, keep your chest come closer to the mat. But make sure your hip as it is. Adjust your alignment and just hold your posture for 30 seconds. Straight up, straight up. Okay, slowly come back. Now one more time. Little bit hunch your back, lock your chin, round your back to counter stretch your back. Inhale neutral position. Cross your leg and slowly drop your hip down. Sit down. Both legs straight forward. Okay. You are doing here for Pachimottanasan, but make sure your knees with bend and lift up your toes up here. Inhale, raise your arm up. Exhale, try to be bent forward here and stretch forward, but make sure your knees is bent. So without straight your knee to bend forward here, look friend. This is totally fine your lower back, but make sure. Compress your abdomen on your thighs and look front. No need this time to keep your legs straight. Only keep your knees come closer. Look front. Keep your knees come closer. And stay there. Only for 30 seconds. This is good for your lower back. When we are feeling our lower back pain. So no need to keep your legs straight and bend forward. You can slightly bend your knee. Totally fine. This is good for your lower back. Try to cup in. Okay, inhale. Come up, raise your arm up. Leg straight. Bend your right leg beside your left knee joint. Your left hand hug your right knee. And the right hand catch your left wrist here. Then keep your knee, come closer to the chest and twist, look back in your wall. Feel the twist in your spine and feel the nice stretch in your right glutes. Twist, look back. Just hold your posture. Just feel the stretch. Keep your knee, come closer to the chest. Come closer to the body. Just try to stay there. Okay, take your time, inhale, come back, reach your arm up, exhale, both hands down, 
Chin the legs, switch the side. So bend your left leg this side, your right knee joint. Right hand hug your left knee. Left hand catch your right wrist and twist. But make sure your both hip come closer to the mat. So here, so your left hip, your left hip come closer to the mat. So that will work. And twist your spine, look back. Just try to feel the nice stretch your left glutes. Feel the twist your spine. Take your time. Inhale. Come back. Raise your arm up. Exhale. Both hands down. And take your time. And slowly and gently lie down on the back and come into bridge pose if you feel comfortable you can catch your ankle here if you feel uncomfortable you can put the palm on the mat easy way and inhale try to lift up your hip up and contract your hip tighter and feel the stretch your quadriceps Feel the stretch in your back and leg. Feel the stretch your whole body also. Here. And push your chest forward to the chin. Exhale, slowly drop your hip down. Only for 10. Inhale, lift up your hip up. Contract your hip tighter. But it's sliding time your palm on the mat. Totally fine. Exhale, slowly down. Inhale, lift the hip up, contract your hip tighter. Exhale, hip down. Inhale, lift the hip up, contract your hip tighter. Exhale, slowly drop your hip down. Inhale, lift the hip up, contract your hip tighter. Exhale down. Inhale, lift. Exhale down. Inhale, lift. Exhale down. Inhale, lift. One more time. Exhale down. Inhale, lift the hip up. Contract your hip muscle tighter and hold. One. Feel a stretch. Two. Three. Four. Five. And six. Drop your hip down. Hug your knee to the chest. Keep your knee come closer to the body and just try to be hold that for 30 seconds. Feel the sensation in your body. Take your time, last one more twist. So bring your left leg straight, right leg beside your Right leg beside your left knee joint, drop your right knee to the left side, press your right hand, press your left hand, your right knee down and your right hand straight to the right side. Push your shoulder down and twist your spine, feel the stretch. Just stay there for 30 seconds and keep twist your spine but make sure push your shoulder to the mat. If your lower back pain you can twist slightly, no too much force and keep your breath very soft and slow push your both shoulder down just twist take your time inhale come back hug your right knee to the chest then slowly right leg straight forward bend your right left leg left leg beside your right knee joint Right hand catch your left knee and keep your left knee come closer to the mat and push your uh, your left hand shoulder level and press your shoulder to the mat twist. 
Feel the better twist for your spine and feel the stretch in your left glute muscle. Take your time. If you feel cramp, you can take your time and gentle twist. No need to too much force in yourself. Just twist. That's it. Totally fine. Okay, take your time. Inhale, come back. Hug your left knee to the chest. Exhale, left leg straight forward. Both palms facing up to the ceiling and relax your body to the mat. Go to the Savasana. Just for three to five minutes for.